Hey guys, it's Kate. So for today's video, I'm going to be showing you my hair care routine, which I'm super, super, super excited for. So let's just get on into it. So first I'll just start off with the flat iron and curling irons that I use and then I will show you the products that I use on my hair when I'm using those or after I'm using those. I don't know. It'll make sense once we get into it. So here we go. So the flat iron I use is just this John Frieda one. I'm not sure how many inches this one is, um, but it's pretty thick as you can tell. I do have a skinnier one of this. This one is actually my sister's um, and I think this is like two and a half inches or three inches. I'm not really sure. Because this flat iron is bigger, it actually speeds up the process of straightening my hair, which is definitely a lifesaver in the morning. And when I'm straightening my hair, obviously I use a heat protectant and the one I use is just this Garnier Fructis sleek and shine flat iron perfecter straightening mist and this is mainly like a straightening mist so um this helps my hair stay perfectly straight so if you have trouble with your hair sticking and you don't uh sticking if you have trouble with your hair staying straight after you straighten it then i recommend using um a straightening mist instead of like regular heat protectant because that will definitely help your hair stay straight all day and then you can also use a hairspray over top of that if you still need to next for the curling irons I use this one is the bigger one I own and it is the Conair sorry if I pronounced that wrong um, it is the Conair infinity pro by Conair it has this like heat clamper but I never really use it that I just wrap my hair around it like normally uh, and then the other curling iron I use is just a little bit smaller and it is also by Conair and it is the instant heat one that's all it says um and you just turn it on right here and then you can adjust the like um heat I guess um it goes from one to 25 I normally keep mine on 25 that way the it'll hold the curl much better and, and if I'm curling my hair I like to use this heat protectant and this is the Tresme thermal creations heat protectant and it has heat protection up to 450 degrees which is really nice because mine goes up to 400 again this one I use for straightening my hair and this one I use for curling my hair so these are just amazing and I love them also, one thing I forgot to mention, um, I use this Bedhead Smoothing Cream for silky, shiny, healthy looking hair. Um, and I use this after I um, straighten my hair just to make it a lot more shiny. Then for dry shampoo, I use a volume extended one and it is again by Garnier Fructis. Um, and it is the Instant Butterfire Dry Shampoo. It's actually for fi fine or flat hair, which is definitely not my hair type. So this does not leave any white residue in your hair. Uh, as long as you like massage it into your scalp, then you are good to go. So you can use almost as much as you want to in your hair without having to worry about the white residue kind of thing if you have darker hair than I do. So as far as the products I use in the shower, I obviously use a standard um, shampoo and conditioner. The specific products that I use are the um, Garnier Fructis kinds and this is the Damage Eraser one and the Sleek and Shine one. I have them in both the shampoo and conditioner. Honestly, I don't have much to say about these. Um, I've been using them per, for probably over a year now, or at least these I've been using for over a year now. Um, but these I got, or my sister got, for Christmas time. So that was super nice. And and then after I get out of the shower, I like to use a anti-frizz serum, which helps your hair obviously if it's frizzy. Uh, this one is from Garnier Fructis. It is the Sleek and Shine Anti-Frizz Serum for frizzy, dry, unmanageable hair, which is my hair type 100%. And then this is the Garnier Fructis Damage Eraser Split End Bandage. And this is amazing. It honestly works so amazingly. I love it. But when I am applying this product, I like to focus it on the ends of my hair because obviously that is where the most split ends are. This just definitely helps the split ends disappear in my hair and I love it. It's honestly such a lifesaver. 
So that is all I have for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And thank you so, so, so much for watching this. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day or night or morning or whenever you are watching this. So I really hope this video was enjoyable and maybe it helped some of you out. I'm not really sure, but if it did help you out, leave a comment below and tell me that it did. And I look forward to reading all of the comments like always. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in four days. Bye. Love it, love it, love it, love it. That was a lot of loves. The, oh, sorry. So that is all that I have for you guys. I don't know why I always do this. I'm sorry. It's probably really, really, really annoying.